Good evening, Freedom Fighters. It is 6.57 p.m. Eastern Time, March 3rd, 2024. Very heavy microwave frequency heart technology system going on today over the United States. Wow, that was unique. See where Texas, that blew up all of a sudden? That was wild out of thin air. But that's spraying there. I want to show you. That's a heavy spray activity that lit up. Heavy spray activity here. That doesn't make any sense. It's not really part of the weather system yet. Right here is all the chemtrails where my hand is. The Gulf of Mexico from Mexico to Pacific Ocean was massive frequency waves pushing this new material and creating a brand new storm in the Gulf of Mexico tonight that was not there. I have watched the weather my entire life. It was always very, very interesting to me. I was never entertained by Hollywood. I only wanted to study my whole life. And weather was a big thing in my life that I studied. None of this looks natural to me. I'm going to zoom in on several different locations. I want to go over the chemtrail operation over Georgia, Alabama, Kentucky, and other states. I want to go over the chemtrail operation that went over Oklahoma and Texas and on into Missouri. As you can see, it just keeps going right on up. That is definitely part of the weather stuff. They have created a massive storm in the Canada. I've never seen anything like it. I'm going to pause. But look at all the frequency waves in these other states pushing this material up. You can see how it's working. Satellites are doing this, your next red radar systems and your 5G harp towers is what I call them, your so-called cell phone towers. But look at these behemoths. They are not for you. Stand by. I want to show you some more stuff of what's going on here. A lot of storms being activated tonight. Okay, I'm over Canada and the northern part of the United States. Doesn't look amazing how fast this material goes. And I heard about the wind today. It's been incredible in these places. When they have this machine up, my wind here in Florida will be 10 miles an hour more than, than forecast if they turn the machine up. Whoever heard of lightning up here in early March, too, up here in Canada? These are electrical storms. They create these with those so-called trillion watt lasers that their scientists talk about. All right, let's move to the Gulf of Mexico. All that weird stuff. Move to the Gulf of Mexico and watch these spots. Uh, storms be lit off with the lasers. All right, this is 7.30 this morning. We had a storm go through already. Normally, that would be over for us. You'll see how they fire off these new storms here. Look how the light really doesn't move. It's in the same spot. Barely moves it in there. Something's weird about it. But they just fire off new storms at will here. Need to be zoomed out a little bit. You see a lot better. A lot faster than that. You can kind of see how these storms just redevelop here. I see that's where I was saying how it just kind of stays stable. Look how the light in the state in one area there. Zoom down was a little bit too much. Right there. Some really fast moving stuff and the storms really not go anywhere. It's because they're relighting it. It's just lighting the storm over and over again. All right, let's move on to the chemtrail in over Georgia and other places here. That's wild out here. What are we creating now? Let's see. Stand by. Okay, we're over Mississippi, Alabama, Tennessee area where they're doing the heavy concentrated spraying when most people can't see. This may be fog. It's in a lower atmosphere. Whatever it is, it might be fog on the ground. But I'm going to put it in thermal and it'll really bring it out. You can see how many lines they have sprayed over these areas. These people, most likely, if that's fog, they have no idea they were poisoned today. Heavy, toxic, slow poisoning of our people. They don't want to kill you quickly. That would be too obvious. These people are enjoying it. Only you ought to realize something. 
think back to the Roman days. They would have coliseums of slave girls release lions where it would eat them and people would cheer. Why is that? Because once you have everything, once you climb the highest mountain, build the biggest homes, our misery is the only thing that brings these people happiness. I want y'all to realize that. Why we got to the Roman days. That is the hells. I want y'all to realize that. That is not nice. The Roman days were hell to people. They were put in arenas and murdered for fun. Heavy chemtrailing over Kansas today. Heavy harp waves over this area here in Nebraska. They're pushing all this stuff to the north. I want you to realize how this stuff works. Every time I show you, it's pushing a certain direction. It has nothing to do with gravity. All these scientists need to be arrested and held for treason. They're lying to the people. Every weatherman on the weather channel needs to be arrested and held for treason. And you know what the penalty of treason is, right? It's death. These people need to be uh, dealt with accordingly. All this material is being pushed to Canada. Their temperatures are super hot compared to what they should be. That's going to create chaos this year like you have never seen. 2024, get ready for the storms. I'm sorry. We've got to fight. We have no choice here. Just like our grandfathers in World War II and World War I, my great-grandfather lost an arm in World War I fighting these people. <sighs> We're fighting the same families we fought 200 years ago or 100 years ago. They just have all our incredible technologies in their hands now. And it's terrifying. They've taught your kids nothing. They own your schools. They own your hospitals. Your doctors are not your best friends. Some of these people are in the worst health I've ever seen humans. And for the people still standing by, the only reason I can't stand the flat earthers because I want critical thinkers here. If you cannot concede that they have satellites evolving around our beautiful round planet, well, there's not much use even talking to those people. If they can't see that we have satellites in outer space, we need to shut that down. That's what's creating all this. I can go out in the thousands of miles out in the ocean and see this material working. It has nothing to do with the radar systems all the time. Yes, it does use them. That's the way they control our hurricanes and stuff. But a lot of this is with heart. And this has all been put up in the last three or four years, these new satellites with this technology. I'm in fear for people's lives. Look at the chemtrail operations thousands of miles offshore right here. Why would they be spraying this far offshore? I think that's like a thousand miles right there. That's your next storm, people. There's your next spray spray job here. That's your next atmospheric river right there coming to you, California. You had a little bit of a break, but I guarantee you, here comes your new one. They're creating it. Thank you for everybody that's still with me. I know there's a couple hundred of you that really do care. I mean care. I know y'all do. I feel y'all. Y'all cry with me.